has said that there is no merit in the plea. The top court has dismissed this plea and now the exams will go on. The exams that started in the beginning of this September. Uh, now this comes on a day when an estimated 2 lakh students are writing their key competitive uh, exams. And the petition was filed by the six opposition rule states, including West Bengal, where West Bengal had also claimed that they, the students, almost 75% of the students could not give their exam on the first day of the examinations. Now, the big uh, news coming in right now is that the Supreme Court has uh, said that the plea does not have any merit and that the exams will go on. The opposition rule states have continuously been raising this issue with the central government as well. They have been asking the government how will they ensure that all the students are able to attend their examinations, that they are able to make their way to the examination centers. There is an issue of transportation availability. Also, many students are worried, the parents are worried about going to examination centers and giving exams, but the central government has made it clear that uh, enough guidelines have been issued and also sufficient measures will be taken to keep the coronavirus at bay while the students are giving examinations. Uh, the social distancing norms will be followed. Each student will be given uh, masks, but the big question uh, that the states kept asking that how would the students reach there? Uh, joining me now is uh, Arunachal Vedian.